<laughs> which, if true, means death for us all. And now, Kent's people. Tonight's inspiring story is about Frank Grimes, a 35-year-old Springfieldite who's earned everything the hard way, but never let adversity get him down. Abandoned by his parents at age four, Frank never got to go to school. He spent his childhood years as a delivery boy, delivering toys to more fortunate children. Then, on his 18th birthday, he was blown up in a silo explosion. During his long recuperation, he taught himself to hear and feel pain again. As the years passed, he used his few leisure moments each day to study science by mail. And last week, Frank Grimes, the man who had to struggle for everything he ever got, received his correspondence school diploma in nuclear physics with a minor in determination. That's the kind of man I need in my team, Smithers. A real strapper. A self-made man like me. Bring this Grimes fellow to me. I want to make him my executive vice president. Yes, sir. Smithies, I've just seen the most heroic dog on television. He pulled a toddler from the path of a speeding car, then pushed a criminal in front of it. Find this dog. I want to make him my executive vice president. Uh, yes, sir. In the meantime, here's Frank Grimes. <clears throat> The self-made man? What? Oh, yes, that fellow. Just put him somewhere out of the way and find that dog. Yes, sir. Rock. Chair goes round. Chair goes round. Hey, homie, you busy? Yes. Uh, there's a new guy at the plant. Uh, maybe we ought to say hi to him. I don't know. Uh, I'm kind of dizzy. I should probably go home sick. You know? Yes. My name is Frank Grimes. I'm Lenny. This is Carl and Homer. I'm Lenny. How do you do? Wow, you got pencils with your name on them, just like a pencil company executive. I'd give anything for one of these. Any office supply company can have them made up for you. Can I have this one? No. Can Lenny have it? No. 